While coffee, in particular the caffeine in it, has countless benefits including alertness, general mental function and reaction time due to it causing changes in several neurotransmitters, there is a group of people, me included, who are highly sensitive to it. Cases of caffeine-induced psychosis have been reported in people with schizophrenia and in otherwise healthy people in which caffeine intoxication has occurred. Caffeine intoxication is characterized by symptoms including nervousness, muscle twitching, rambling speech and sleeplessness following a dose of caffeine exceeding 250 milligrams. Caffeine can cause panic attacks by interfering with a denison, a brain chemical, that typically has a calming effect. But it also raises levels of lactate, a biochemical implicated in producing panic attacks. Moderate and high consumers have shown to demonstrate higher levels of anxiety and depression than those who didn't consume it. High consumers also have a higher incidence of stress-related medical problems and a lower academic performance. I recommend in Unstoppable, people who are battling depression and anxiety to wean themselves off caffeine over a 30-day period.